We have been getting tens of thousands, nearly hundreds of thousands of new users referred to our website from ChatGPT. People go to ChatGPT and they ask questions that are related to our domain. For example, we have a video editing website and they ask questions related to audio and video tasks. And because we have articles that are written about those tasks and web pages optimized for that specific use case, our website is cited in the sources that ChatGPT gives when it answers the question. Users click through on those links and they are referred to our website in order to complete the task. So I want to talk about how do you get your own website to show up in generative engines. We're calling this new domain generative engine optimization or GEO rather than the traditional SEO or how you get your website to rank on Google. Mostly we treat SEO as similar to GEO. You want to think about natural language queries that people are looking for and create resources that directly respond to the searcher's intent. What's different is two things that we have noticed from reading the literature. One is that if you include data, especially recent data, like data from 2025, your pages seem to be more likely to rank or to get referenced by ChatGPT. The second thing we've noticed is that ChatGPT seems to prefer proper citations in articles and web pages. So we've started adding more proper citations, literally MLA citations at the bottom of our articles where we didn't used to do that. So those are two ways that SEO differs from GEO.